605, we are following developing news in Waterbury. Right now, two people, including a 10-year-old child, are recovering at Waterbury Hospital after someone shot them. It all happened last night on Congress Avenue. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Roger Suzanne joins us now live right outside Waterbury Police Headquarters. Roger, have investigators named any suspects? Yeah, good morning, Nicole. Good morning, Caitlin. Unfortunately, at this point, police have not made any arrests or even named any suspects. And right now, they're actually hoping that someone who saw something that could be useful to them will contact police right away so that they can figure out exactly who is responsible and bring them to justice. I want you to take a look at some video that we captured earlier and show you the scene where this actually happened. This is on Congress Avenue in Waterbury. And last night, around 7.30, police rushed out here after reports of gunfire in the area. Now, when they actually arrived, both of the victims, were told, had left the area. But a short time later, two victims, a 20-year-old man and a 10-year-old child, actually walked into Waterbury Hospital. We're told the one bit of good news is they are expected to be okay. That adult was shot in the leg and the child was shot in the ribs. But again, their injuries are not considered life-threatening right now. But again, this, of course, is a very unsettling crime, a shocking crime in many ways, and police are trying to figure out exactly who is responsible. They're looking for either a suspect or multiple suspects. And again, if you have any information that could be useful, you're urged to call the Waterbury Police Department right away. Right now, those victims, by the way, are recovering at Waterbury Hospital. Reporting live in Waterbury, I'm Roger Suzanne, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.